Hi, we are here, live on the softball field with Mark. Where are you, where are you from, Mark? I'm from Eastern Maryland. I um, live in Salisbury right now. Um, how long you have been in the Spectrum Olympics, Maryland? For a couple of years. What sports do you play? I play softball, football, and that's about it. I got, a, I got a few questions about the game, okay? I know you have a, a rough start, in a, a good start in the first couple of innings. What are your chances to of that inning? Well, I try to keep my head high and keep keep my head high and um, play with my folks. That's good. Um, I know you have a rough game today's game. Um, I know it's hard to um, lose from Howard County, but you had a great chance to win and didn't end. So how that happened, though? Well, I don't, I don't know, but we tried. Um, when I go back to the dorm, talk to my team, tell them we tried. But tomorrow we're gonna come out here, play our hardest, and try to win, win that gold. Well, I was, I want to wish you luck for tomorrow's game against Kill County. Good luck and do your best. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Hi, I'm here live from the softball. This is Coach Pam talk about Mark. So, how is Mark doing in the game today? Oh, uh, Mark did very well in the game today. He um, hustled actually, but one time he was laying on the ground, you know, and he got back up after that and he was, you know, wanted to stay in the game. He didn't want to get out of the game. And he yeah. worked, I thought he did an awesome job at first. Yeah, um, I know it's hard to, um, to end the game, but I'm sorry, sorry about that. But right. what are you going to do um, for tomorrow's game, though? Well, first we're going to rest yeah. and go and get in the shade. And then tonight we'll come out and watch the Home Run Derby because we have another athlete who's in, um, our pitchers in the Home Run Derby, Jason. And then um, we're just going to think about positive things, what we did good yet, yet today. I mean, the first game was we were really strong. And the second game, that one inning is the only inning that really hurt us. And we just need to work on, um, think about helping each other out and playing the ball no matter where, you know, we are. Well, also, I got a question right now. I know um, people love you guys, see you sharing crowd. But what are you going to do with the um, our crowd here tomorrow, skiing and rest up stuff? What are you going to do with that? Well. Um, I really just try to tell them to focus on the game, sure. all right? Everybody's different. Come out, play your game, try to listen to your coaches, okay? And um, do the best you can do. I just ask them to play the best they can. I know it's getting a hard, the best of the experience, to play hard, great times. Mm -hmm. um, how many athletes are in, in this game, though, with all uh, softball? Well, you have, you have 10 on the field. You can actually play with a, an extra player. You can play with an EP, which makes it 11. And just depending on um, the coach's choice, this, it has to do a lot with batting. And if you have, an, like, a person who's a strong batter, that you might want to just have them bat most of the game. Or uh, like thank that. you very much, Pam, for that. And also for Mark, too. Right. He's the athlete of the month of July. Mm -hmm. So um, what are you going to do with Mark? Mark is doing great today. What am I going to do with him? Yeah. Um, I'm going to do with him like I do with all the other guys. I'm going to tell them how good they did. I'm gonna, we're going to get pizza tonight. They're going to have a good time. And we're going to try to forget about the things that were, didn't do that well today and think about the good things. Uh, thank you very much, Pam. Thank we are gathered here. Thank yeah. you very much for my live softball stadium. And we here. Thanks. Bye-bye.